Emily, a big opportunity for some students in the upstate. Two career centers are teaming up to cook for you. And you're going to see these budding chefs at Artisphere this year. Christine Scarpelli, she's live with some of them this morning at the Golden Strip Career Center in Malden. Hey, Christine. Hey guys, they're working pretty hard this morning. Yeah, and this is way earlier than maybe they would normally work hard. They're coming here to show off their skills for you guys this morning and really prep for a competition at Artisphere. So you can support these fantastic students from Golden Strip and Donaldson Center culinary programs. They're going to be competing on Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Downtown Greenville Artisphere is coming. We've got some video of that, but first, let's introduce Eli this morning. Eli. Uh oh, Christine, can you hear us? We corn? lost you. Yes, ma'am. Uh, oh, my goodness. We're making a uh, Mexican street corn this weekend in Artisphere. It's called a lote. So okay. we, we've created a chipotle lime cilantro mayo. Um, chipotle lime cilantro mayo. Yes, ma'am. And um, so on site, we'll torch it just like you saw on the news, give them a little action shot. And uh, I'll show you kind of kind of what it's going to look like towards Please. the end. Um, oh, yeah. Paint on your mayo mixture. Uh, the corn itself is super sweet, so the spicy mayo is going to give a nice contrast on that, give it enough mm. to give it a nice taste. And then you've got a little of this uh, cotilla cheese. Oh, stop. Oh, yeah. Oh. You don't want to stop there, though. You're going to finish it with the, um, oh, the bright, my. vibrant taste of a little bit of cilantro. And tell me why you guys go and do all of this. It's got to be a lot of work to get everything and get to Artisphere. It's a little labor intensive, but for these students, uh, I can't explain enough how much this is going to give them the experience to work in, a, in an event of uh, just this magnitude and this size. So they're going to see, uh, you know, the ins and outs of how catering can be crazy, but also just like the time of their life. So I'm really hoping that they pull a couple of uh, great life stories from this. So. Yeah, you know, there's a lot of professional chefs out there as well. They may be going into that role eventually. So we look forward to that and what they can learn there. Guys, hang with us all morning. Hey, more of this coming up. Back to you. That looks amazing. I would totally eat corn Absolutely. like that. Absolutely. Yeah. Thanks, Christine.